Uh, I'm for more health care and Fred Upton votes to take health care away. And, you know, in health care got really personal for me a few years ago when my partner, Chris, uh, came into some medical trouble. You know, I came home from, a, from being in the legislature and I found Chris on the floor. Uh, he'd been vomiting for 18 hours. He was barely able to move. And we had a fight about whether we were going to call an ambulance because ambulances are expensive. I won that fight and we got him to the hospital. Uh, and after hours of tests and treatment, they stabilized him. Uh, and he said, doc, I still see double. And the doctor said, that's not what you came in for. So we're discharging you, which meant we had to go back to his primary care doctor the next day, who at the very beginning of the exam, almost immediately sent us back to the emergency room. And that led to more tests, MRIs with contrast, MRIs without lab tests, until finally the doctor walked in and said to Chris, I think you have multiple sclerosis. And for anybody who's been in that situation where the questions feel so big and you as a caregiver feel so small, you know exactly what I was going through. And then that started a fight where we had to fight with insurance companies to make sure he got the care he needed. We fought, had a fight to get him into the right uh, healthcare access and find a treatment program. And now we're also like every one of those other families who at the start of every year, we hope that the prescription medications that keep him healthy are still gonna be covered by his employer and his insurance, right? And it's just, this isn't right. And so, you know, I'm someone who thinks that we need to, uh, that we need to expand healthcare. You know, we need to be making sure that we are, uh, I've been supportive of, of ideas like Medicare for all, you know, but I'm an all of the above person when it comes to healthcare, I'm gonna vote for whatever we can do today to make healthcare better tomorrow, because there's too many people like Chris who have a pre-existing condition, which Fred Upton voted to gut coverage for people with pre-existing condition 12 times. 